What's good sneaker fam, welcome back to our sneakers. If you're new to the channel, then you might not know, but I am doing a Yeezy giveaway on this channel. Go down in the description below, look for Yeezy giveaway, click on the link next to it, and then follow all those entries. You do get one entry for every single thing that you do. Anyways, today I'm here to talk about why you shouldn't buy Yeezys for resale. I know it sounds dumb because you're probably like, okay, if I can't buy them for retail, then why wouldn't I buy them for resale? Because that's the only way to get them. This video is more for raising awareness to not buy fake Yeezys because Yeezys nowadays, they're getting so good, like, you can barely tell if they're fake. Like, I guess so many people asking me all the time, like, I already told you guys back in the past, like, go ahead and DM me your pictures of your Yeezys that you guys want me to legit check, and I'll do it. Like, I don't have a problem with that. But there's times where I don't know, because it's, like, it's in the middle, because it's only through pictures, but in person, I can tell a lot better. But then, the majority of the pictures that I get, they're fake Yeezys. It's usually people selling fake Yeezys online. Probably through Craigslist, eBay, or, her, I don't know, their friend that got the Yeezys for, like, 20 bucks. And they're sending them pictures, whatever it is. They really, there's just so many fakes out there. Like, I realize that there's more fakes than there is authentic pairs out there, which is surprising to me. I've, I, I feel like in total, I've had, I wanna say, 100 people ask me to do legit checks, and I think 10 out of those 100 were real. So that's approximately like a 10% that are real compared to the 90% that are fake. So you have a way greater chance of getting scammed and getting a fake pair than you do of getting a real pair. It's very scary. I know it sounds like, I know you guys are probably like, oh, this guy's BS. No, it's, crazy i didn't think it was like that either i thought there was a lot i didn't think that many fakes were out there but there is so many it's, it's ridiculous this video is more for the people that lack knowledge in the sneaker game and more than anything in the yeezy game i guess you want to if you want to call it that way yeezys you gotta know how to tell like i try to make as many videos for you guys telling you guys how to legit check them comparisons and i've done two comparisons with three comparison videos so far and i tried my best on those but the best one obviously was the cream white one because i had like four different yeezys the real one and the three other ones that were fake and that was the best one by far because there was that many variations of fakes that you guys can like check what to look for i did a blue one as well but i only had one fake and the fit that one wasn't too bad i also had the red ones but those weren't that bad either but to the average sneakerhead he's not gonna know how to tell what's real from fake but if you guys want to go ahead and pull up like my video whenever you're doing a trade then go ahead and do that i mean if it helps and also there's a sneaker account called fake education i'm pretty sure like all you guys probably know about him. I asked him to use his pictures in my videos, but he said no. So I didn't really use his pictures and I just kind of just showed you guys, which it would have been helpful a lot easier if I put his pictures in the corner as I did the comparisons, but he didn't let me. So that's fine. It's whatever. But I'm still going to like give him a shout out by saying like, go ahead and go to him, go to his Instagram because he has like compare. He has like fake versus real on almost all his Instagram of every shoe. Like that's all his Instagram is. He has a few pictures of himself there here and there, but for the most part, he has almost every like big hype release with a fake shoe and a real shoe. So when you go to get a shoe, go ahead, if you want, go ahead and pull it up and look it up, compare it. I mean, it might be weird to do it in front of the person, but if you really just don't want to get scammed, then go ahead and do it. Like the person probably understand. I mean, they, they'll probably be like, what the hell is this kid doing? But if they're legit, then they're gonna let you do it. If they're fake, then they're probably gonna be like, I don't know, they'll probably be a little iffy. If you lack the knowledge in Yeezys, just stay away from buying resale unless it's from like go and stock x and i said this in the past when you buy from consignment shops go that extra step to find out if they're real or not because like i said in the past there's a one percent chance you could get a pair of fakes i know it's very low but it's still possible now as for those people that know about yeezys then you know about yeezys like you really this video really isn't for you i should have said that at the beginning but if you know about them then and you know how to legit check them and you know 100 percent you'll be safe buying I mean, not buying, but like looking at any pair and knowing it's real, then go ahead and by all means, go ahead and buy the shoe. But this is more for the people that lack knowledge in Yeezys. A lot of times people get hyped up to get Yeezys and then when they do and they end up being fake, they end up being so bummed out. I know it sucks because you you have like such a limited shoe. It's like, oh, you have something expensive, something very materialistic. But then in the end, it's you that spent your hard earned money just to lose it to a pair of fakes, basically. I'm just trying to save you guys a hassle. Anyways, before I go, I do got to give a shout out to today's fan of the day. And today's fan of the day is Chaos Hades. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Click that button right here down below, somewhere around there, or it's on the corner here. I don't know exactly which one. But make sure you subscribe. Anyways, make sure you stay woke. Well. Our sneaker signing out. Alcatraz. Peace.